Thank you, Constable Habib. No chalky hobnobs. I'm afraid not, sir. Only rich tea. Well, perhaps that's as it should be. Perhaps a man who has failed in his duty to society doesn't deserve his choice of Bicky. How's that, sir? That lad we're holding in the interview room. Arrogant, rude, opinionated, unpleasant. <laughs> he could be my own son. You think so, sir? Yes, I do. Tomorrow, perhaps, it will be my boy. The lad we've collared comes from a broken home, just like my lad. Broken home? It's a terrible thing to say, sir. Lots of couples split up. It doesn't mean their kids are going to turn out to be louts. Uh, true, true. I suppose the first six children in line to the throne come from broken homes. That's right, sir. Can't see much chance of us pulling William and Harriford to off... <laughs> ..taken without consent. <laughs> Thank you, Constable Habib. You have a wise head on those young shoulders. I'd like to say something else, if that's all right, Inspector. Very well, Constable. What is it? Well, it's none of my business, but I think you might worry a bit less about your old relationships and a bit more about your current one. Sergeant Dawkins, you mean? I know it's not my place to interfere, sir, but, well, she does seem very low. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, well, perhaps you're right. Thank you for bringing this matter to my attention, Constable. <laughs> I will act on information received. 